What is going on, people? It is your boy, Daddy Mac, and welcome back to another Pokemon Sword and Shield Wi-Fi battle. So, as you can see, we're bringing a new but old team. This is a team we first used when uh, Pokemon Sword and Shield first released. I think this was with Wi-Fi battle number nine that we used, starting at Wi-Fi battle number nine. Um, nine moving forward. But anyways, we're against a mono rain team. Wow. Um, honestly, I don't even know what to do. I don't know who to start with. Um, I'm afraid of, the, of a lot of his Pokemon, to be quite honest. I'm going to start with Morpeko, given that I... Or I can also start with Serena. No, I'm going to start with Morpeko because... Uh, Swampert's a thing. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to start with... With Sincino. Because we got a choice band on it. And we have U-turn, so... We can U-turn out of there if all comes to... If all else fails. But we also have the uh, Bullet Seed. This is a... This is a um, a what is that ability called that Cloyster has? Um, skill link. This is a skill link choice banded jolly nature Cincino. So, this is gonna be very fun to me. So, all right, so we're gonna go ahead and, and start with the Cincino, which is actually very good. This is exactly why I did not want to start more Peko. So, Swampert comes out, and we automatically threaten this thing with a bullet seed, which is exactly what we're going to do here in a moment. I'll go over my new team with you guys. All right, so. Weakens this attack, unfortunately. This is not gonna knock out, is it? Okay, yeah, so it's only one that it knocks out. This is this should knock out then. Two. This is definitely a knockout. So Swamper, we can honestly bolt switch moving forward and go out into more Peko and just knock things out. So that's very exciting to me. It's a crit! Not that it mattered or anything like that, but you know, that was clutch by Centino. I can't believe he didn't switch out. I would have switched out if I were him. Now, for this team, I, I already said this last week, but this team is built for and um, inspired from my daughter, Arya. So if she had a Pokemon team, these are the Pokemon I feel that she would have. So we got Cincino with the Skill Link, Choice Band, U-Turn, Bullet Seed, Rock Blast, Tail Slap, you name it. We got Serena with the U-Turn, High Jump Kick, Play Rough, Trop Kick. We got, we got the Gardevoir with the Thunderbolt, um, Psychic, Shadow Ball, Moonblast. This is a, a Choice Scarf, Serena, as you can see, obviously. We got Choice Specs, Gardevoir. Milotic with the Safeguard. Why do I have Safeguard on this? Um, I don't remember. I don't remember. I think it should be Recover. It should definitely be Recover. I don't know why I got Safeguard on here. Okay, so we got Milotic, which um, is unfortunately messed up right now. But we also got Gudra with the uh, Assault Vest, which we're about to go into with the Surf, Ice Beam, Flamethrower, and the Draco Meteor. And lastly, we got Bolt Switch, Psychic Fangs, Fake Out, Aurora Wheel, um, Focus Sash, and Morpeko, which is actually one of my favorite Pokemon. And I know I say that a lot about a lot of Pokemon, but when I have good experiences with Pokemon in Wi-Fi battles, I will love that Pokemon to death. I kid you not. So my opponent goes for the U-turn. I show that I, I reveal that I have Gooey Gudra, not Sap Sipper, which actually doesn't matter if I have Sap Sipper in this on this Gudra for this particular Wi-Fi battle. And I got a feeling he's gonna go out into the Kingdra. I hope he goes out into the Kingdra and I hope the Kingdra is special because I at least will be able to take an attack given that I'm an Assault Vest. I'll be able to take a Draco. I also resist the water type attack, so I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. What are you gonna go out into? In all reality, it's going to be hard for him to go out into anything. Now, the Swift Swim Poliwrath is going to be a Pokemon to watch out for, obviously. Swift Swim Poliwrath is definitely a force to be reckoned with. I have a bunch of drinks on my table. That is not even funny. So, Queen comes out, the Kingdra, and this is actually what I wanted. So, I'm not mad. I'm going to Draco Meteor here. Dragon Pulse will be able to live this. We'll, we'll take at least one of them. I guarantee it. There you go. And as long as I don't miss this, we'll be Gucci. We took out Kingdra. Now, this team has a lot of threats. And when I say a lot of threats, I mean a lot of threats. Because the next biggest threat is that Swift Swim Polyrath in the back. This was one of the biggest threats. But we also have other threats to worry about. Now, Pelipper doesn't really concern me. Young Scrap, who is this? The Polyrath. 
the polyrath. Um, what do I do here? What do I do here? I mean, I can my Lodic. I can go into the Milotic. Do I still need you? I do. I need you for the Pelipper in particular. Now, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go out into Milotic here. This is a bold nature um, Milotic, fully invested into defense and HP. So this is going to be good for us. Now, all of my Pokemon are in Love Ball, so this is awesome. Just like last team. Oh, that's a crit, and it didn't matter. It's a crit! Okay, so Milotic. Takes it like a champ. She's a beast. And lastly, what we're gonna do, do I want, what do I have coil, what am I? Uh, don't ask me, I'm always thinking with this Milotic. For real. <laughs> uh, this is definitely the wrong Milotic. Um, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. I need to, I need to obviously redo this Milotic. Now, my load is kind of worthless to me, to be honest. I'm just going to surf. I, I don't got anything for this thing, so. So, you're going to go out into the Crush, who is the Lapras Water Absorb. Cool. Get that. Oh, it's not Water Absorb, actually. That does some decent damage. That does some very decent damage. Now, my load is kind of valuable to me, mostly because it can take the hits from the Poliwrath. Um... But that's the only reason why, to be quite honest with you. What does Safeguard do again? That is conditions. We're protected from them. Um, I mean, it'll help us against the the gosh darn Toxapex. I'm going to surf one more time. I kind of want to see what this thing wants to do. They're going to Dynamax. Okay. We actually had this conversation the last time. No, not last time. The, the, the time before the last battle. You guys know how I feel about Dynamax. If you guys are regular viewers of my channel, that is. Okay, so Crush is going to go big boy on me. And I'm actually okay with that because I'm going to go big boy on Morpeko later. And, and Crush is not going to appreciate that. Okay, so Max Lightning. Well, obviously, that, that's going to hurt. That's going to hurt a lot. And I don't want to switch out here. I'm going to stay into the Milotic. The reason behind that is because I got no switch-ins for this Lapras. Eventually, what I want to do, I want to come into the Morpeko and just hit everything with the Electric-type attack. That's what I'm going to do eventually, and that's gonna that's what I'm going to do to win this. Um, I mean, technically speaking, I can't go into the Serena or even the Gudra. I'm going to go into the Gudra here and just fire off a Draco. If you if you've hit me with the Ice Beam, that's perfectly fine. I'm okay with it. Max Lightning. I resist this, though, so we're good. And I think I outspeed. I could be wrong, but I think I outspeed. We're gonna try it out. And we're gonna just fire off a Draco. Why don't you go for your Ice Type attack? Go for the Resonance. You kinda need it. You kinda need it. Come on. What you gonna do, Crush? I'm gonna Draco Meteor here. Does some pretty good damage. And, uh, um, Gudra's gonna go down here. So there's the resonance. Now what I'm gonna do next, I'm just gonna go out into the Serena. No, I'm gonna go out into the uh, into the Centino, and I'm just gonna fire off some Rock Blast. That's what I'm gonna do. Fire off some Rock Blast, and that's gonna be game, game, game. Well, probably not game, right? But it's gonna definitely, you know, make the slappers cry. That's the final turn of Dynamax for you, and I still haven't used my Dynamax, so you already know you're gonna cry a little bit when I go Dynamax. I'm gonna go for the Bullet Seed, or no, I wanna go for the Rock Blast. That's what I'm gonna do here. And obviously, since is actually a valuable Pokemon for this Wi Fi battle, also, because I can get rid of the Pelipper eventually with the Rock Blast, and obviously the other uh, of his Water type Pokemon, so. That does nothing! Oh my goodness. Two. Can we get another crit? Oh, well this will knock out, actually. Four and five. We barely get that knockout, but we got it. Lapras goes down. And then, honestly, on this next turn... Oh, if he goes Pelipper, then that's that's great for me. That's great for me, because I'm going to click Rock Blast again. 
the rain wearing off right here is the best thing ever. So yeah, Hot Spinner comes out. The Palipper with the Drizzle. This Mono team is good. I've just played very good Pokemon. It's like saying I played very good football, but I'm playing very good Pokemon. Okay, we're gonna Rock Blast here. It should, oh, it's not gonna get rid of the Hot Spitter. Who am I kidding? Who am I kidding? This is gonna be like a four hit KO. Well, obviously more than that because of the Rock Blast, but we gotta click Rock Blast like two or three times in order for this to knock out, so. All right, U-turn, that's perfectly fine. I'm staying in, should be able to take this, this, take this attack. And then he's probably gonna come into the Polyrath. And what I'm gonna do as my counter, I'm gonna go out into the Milotic and just kind of stall a little bit. Young Scrap comes out. And I'm gonna stall a little bit with the um, Milotic. I can't recover or anything like that, so this isn't gonna be any crazy. Um, it's not gonna be nothing crazy. I need, a, I need to do something real quick. Okay. Now, he went for the bulk up. I did hear that. And honestly, I just surfed. There's nothing I can do, to be honest. I just gotta wait for this rain to go off. And I also have to wait for um, the, oh, drain punch. We'll take that. And we also have to wait for the, for the rain and for the uh, resonance to wear off the screens, the veil. That's what I'm looking for, the Aurora Veil. And this is probably the last turn of it, if not the next turn. So my Lodic served its purpose, even though it's the wrong my Lodic, unfortunately. I wasn't able to do what I wanted to do with it. But that's perfectly fine. We bulk up again. I'm okay with that. I got a special attacker in the back for you, my friend. Okay, so this Polyrath is putting in some work against my Pokemon. And I honestly don't even know why, it's because even with the Swift Swim, I'll be able to, you know, come into the Morpeko I am sashed and knock this thing out. I can actually Bolt Switch out of there. I can Fake Out and Bolt Switch. But like I said, I'm waiting. I think the Bell already wore off. If not, this is definitely the last turn because it's been going on forever, it feels like, at least. And it doesn't. Wow. Okay. That's fine. What I'm gonna do here, I really wanna try to get some chip damage off of this thing. I don't think Serena will do the trick. I'm gonna go out to Gardevoir. Gardevoir, because I really want to force out the water type attack. I obviously don't. I, I, I still need Serena and my other Pokemon. Let me see. Um, last turn of Aurora Veil, finally, okay. So I'm just gonna Moonblast. Oh, my controller didn't respond and I clicked. That's, that's okay, because I'm gonna go down here anyways, right? Yeah, that's definitely a one-hit KO. Easily, easily a one-hit KO. So finally this thing wears off. I'm just gonna come out into the Morpeko. I'm gonna I'm gonna fake out and I'm gonna bolt switch out of there. That's what we gotta do. I'm gonna fake out. Maybe we or no. No, because he has too much bulk bulk ups. Way too much. So we flinch, that's fine. That's exactly what we want, because we want to try to get rid of this rain at ASAP. So Drain Punch, that's perfectly fine. I know you're going to get hella HP back. Hit me with that with that Drain Punch, get your HP all the way back up. So I did all that work for nothing, and then we're just going to Bolt Switch out of here. Wow, this thing is as bulky as they come, isn't it? So Morpeko won't be able to do what I want it to do, essentially. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go Serena, and I think I got a Trop Kick here. So the rain finally stops. Okay, so we're good, we're good. We're definitely good here. Um, Trop Kick, that's Stab. I almost went Play Rough, thinking this thing was a Fairy type, but it's not. Lower its attack a little bit. And you're gonna hit me with the Ice Punch. Oh, you're running Ice Punch. We take it, that's exactly what we're wanting. We're gonna drop kick one more time. And then obviously for the um, for the Toxapex, we need the Centino. Easily, easily, easy, 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 easy. Okay, 
So Young Scraps attack falls. Ice Punch again. We finally get rid of this Poliwrath. Finally. Now what I'm going to do here... I'm going to go... I'm going to go with Cincino, and I'm just going to U-turn out of there. A U-turn should be enough to knock this Poliwrath out. It should be. If it's not... Oh, no, it's not very effective, so it's not going to be... Tail Slap. I got a Tail Slap. You withdraw? That's, that's okay. Oh, he's actually going to try to win this with that. Okay. Respectable. I think he wins. I do think he won this. Wow, I kind of messed up. I'm an idiot. I got overconfident in this Wi-Fi battle. I got overconfident. Now I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. Oh my goodness. Why does that happen to me? <laughs> Young Scrap comes out. And it's game. I have to Dynamax, man. I'm sorry. Even at that, I don't have candies on this, so it's, it's game. We're just going to see Mencino. We're going to see Mencino blow up. Actually, I think we're... Oh, man, what I should have done is Dynamax more Peko. Because I forgot I have the fake out. This was all for nothing, man. I'm sorry. And he's going to drain punch here. Oh, I outspeed. What? I was not expecting to outspeed this thing. Are you not fully invested in speed? What just happened? What? I am as confused as you are. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Apex Predator comes out. The top of the Toxapex. And honestly... What do I do here? I think we overgrowth. I think we overgrowth. That's what that's what we're gonna do. Because I want to get some residual HP, at least on Morpeko or this thing, or or um, or Cincino. That's what I want to do. And then I'm gonna max strike because 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 it's stab. Toxic. Wow. Okay. I'm okay with that. We're gonna have a hard time getting rid of this Toxapex, I can already tell. I can already tell, I'm not gonna have fun. Okay, now we max strike. It's stab, that's, that's the best attack move, that's the best attack that I have on my Tintino against the Toxapex. I just hope I can knock out. That doesn't get damage, I'll take that. I'll definitely take that. Liquidation does a lot of damage. It's a crit! That's a lot of, my opponent has had nothing but crits today. Nothing but crits, this is gonna be a draw. This is gonna be a draw, what, because of the timer. Just don't timer stall me, bruh, please. That's all I ask for. And we're gonna go, this is back, this is my last turn of Dynamax, we're gonna tail slap here, and hopefully we knock out. That's all I'm hoping for, come on. Tail slap. I'm hoping I get a crit. Painful bunker, you gotta do what you gotta do to win. I understand that. I really do. Protects himself, I'm already poisoned, so nothing happens to me. I would really like to see how this game ends, though. I really do, because I think Toxapex has enough power to stop me out. I mean, Marpeko is at one HP, so all he has to do is either hit the Toxic or hit the Painful bunker. And that's it. And that's it. Tail slap. One, two, three, four. Who knows? Maybe I would have won. Recover. Oh, never mind. This thing would stall me out. Painful bunker, and I would have lost him with more Peko. At least I think. That's that's my theory at least. I need a crit. He's had two crits. Can I get one crit? Please. 
I think I got a crit against the Swampert, unless that was last Wi-Fi battle. Okay, you're gonna, that's okay, you're gonna go ahead and hit me with that, uh, Baneful Bunker. And this is gonna be a draw. That's it! That's the Wi-Fi battle, this one was, this one was good. Baneful Bunker. And that's okay. Hell Slap. And that's the Wi-Fi battle. There's too much animations going on. This was a good Wi-Fi battle. I like Wi-Fi battles that come down to the wire like this. Now I did get too overconfident. That's that's my lesson on this Wi-Fi battle. And honestly, that's it. We're just gonna chill. That's it. That's it! This is the Wi-Fi battle. I mean, technically, no, Aura Will would be my best attack. This would be my best attack. I think Bolt Switch, I, I mean, Fake Out is less priority than, um, than Main Full Bunker. Yeah, because he protects himself, so. We're just gonna have it a draw. It's a draw. Um, I definitely would have lost that one. I'm pretty sure. I, I have no afterthoughts about that. That was just really good. But I'm taking your lead card. That was really close. Really, really close. That's going to be it for this Wi-Fi battle. Thank you guys so much for watching. It's your boy, Daddy Mac. Make sure you leave a like if you enjoyed. Comment down below on your thoughts about the Wi-Fi battle. Or if you want to battle me, you know, grab the Discord in the bottom. Join it. And, um... What was I going to say? And hit me up. We'll, we'll have a Wi-Fi battle. That's going to be it. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe to my channel. We have Wi-Fi battles three times a week. It's your boy Daddy Max signing off. I'll see you guys next time.